it feels pretty light right now and it will all day, so we're all good. We're, uh, we're at St. Mary's where I went to school and played hockey here for uh, four of the best years of my life, so I thought it'd be nice to bring a play here and let some people get some pictures. So, got a bit of a crowd here, it's fun, it's good. Stopped in East Coast Lifestyle, a flagship store. Alex McLean is the founder of uh, East Coast Lifestyle, a great maritime company. And so he did heat up our t shirts for our party this afternoon. So that's all we bring it by the store for. So we're going to Duggars. I brought in here to Bubba Ray's. Uh, good friends of mine own this place and they're uh, supported me obviously since I've been here. So they're, they're taking care of us at the party. We said we'd give you guys a half hour at your bar and I uh, really appreciate them over the years. So it's the stuff you do for them. So for Brad and, and Daniel and everybody here. It's awesome. Couldn't be more happy. <laughs> Now we're on our way into uh, the house that my mother grew up in. So uh, she spent her entire childhood here. And my uncle Ross lives here now, so we're gonna go and, uh, and show him the cup and bring it into his living room. So that's where we're heading now. While we're in this house, well, this is very important for me and for my mother and for my aunts and uncles to be here because this is the house that they grew up in. So while we're in this kitchen, we're going to do a quick toast for two people that couldn't be here but that we'd prouder, prouder than hell to be here. My, my grandfather Harry, who I never met, but I heard such wonderful things about and we loved to have this in his house. And for my grandmother, she, she was here, here. one of the best people in the world. Here, here. Prouder than hell to have this thing here. So I wish they were here, they're not. So we're they are here. here. We're gonna do a quick here. toast, so I want my, the four of them to have a sip out of it in their honor. So, Mom, you get to start. Oh my God! <laughs> I love it! I love it! <laughs> His future in hockey is exceptional. He's an exceptional guy. I couldn't be more proud of him. No one's more deserved, except for maybe his dad. That's coming next year. One of the things about Ryan that I admire so much is that he has a true passion for the game as well. And like I've always, when we raised our kids, the emphasis wasn't on what you're going to do. The emphasis was, we want you to wake up in the morning and we want you to go to work and love what you do. And Ryan really loves what he does. And it's a tough job being a pro scout. Uh, he does an awful lot of travel. So you really have to have a true passion for the game and Ryan has that passion. And so we couldn't be more proud. So he's been in the league, oh, I don't know, seven, eight years. And he's got his first cup and I've been chasing mine for 42 years, but I'm chasing mine until I get it. This is an unbelievable day and thank you for doing this for all of us. I know it's your day and that you've been so generous in sharing it with all of us. And none of us would be here today if it wasn't for you, so thank you for that. Ryan's had so much passion and um, commitment to the game of hockey. He's always loved hockey. We, like I grew up, obviously idolizing him, and um, <laughs> sorry. 
Well, obviously, it's a huge accomplishment. You know, it goes from being an intern in Atlanta, making 10 bucks an hour, to progressing to being a pro scout with one of the best organizations in the league and bringing home the Stanley Cup. And I know he's, we're all proud to be Maritimers included. And it's been able to share the experience with everyone that means a lot to him and all the you know, places that mean a lot in the, in the city and in, in the province. And everyone's really proud of him, like ourselves included. And it's been a great day. It's been a blur, but it's been a lot of fun, <laughs> and I'm so thrilled to share it with everybody here. <laughs>